EKU football opened the 2016 season at Purdue, and the Boilermakers would take advantage of some early turnovers to jump out to a 21-point lead. But the Colonels wouldn't just roll over. Under four minutes left in the first, and Benny Coney finds Devin Borders down the sideline for a 26-yard gain. Coney, looking to keep a drive alive, finds Matt Clark, who makes a sliding catch. Next play, Coney hits Nico Creamer, who stays on his feet for an 11-yard gain. Colonel's facing a third and seven from the Purdue 10-yard line, and Coney puts one up for Dan Crimmins to come down with. Coney was four for four for 64 yards on the drive. Eastern elects to go for two, and Creamer finds the pylon for the conversion. Colonel's second possession of the second quarter, and they methodically move the ball down the field. But the drive stalls just inside the red zone, and Lucas Williams knocks down a 35-yard field goal. Ensuing possession, Boilermakers looking to convert on a third and long, but Nigel Bethel steps in front of this pass for his first interception as a colonel. So Eastern starts in Purdue territory, and Coney hits LJ Smith in the flat for a 14-yard gain. Then Benny uses his two hyped feet to convert consecutive third and twos, setting the stage for Ethan Thomas to turn the corner and break a tackle for a 10-yard touchdown run. And the Colonels are only down 10 at the break. EKU would hold Purdue scoreless in the third quarter, but the Boilermakers would manage to pull away in the fourth. So Eastern will look to get on the winning track next week with their home opener Thursday night against the University of Pikeville. I'm David Miller for EKU Sports.